our campaign did not start with Mr. David Ong's resignation. We don't work only when the elections come. We continually upgrade ourselves. We continually to make ourselves better, despite the very dismal results that were shown to us in the last general election. But that's that's SDP. That's who we are. The can-do party. The party that never says die. That credit does not come to me. It doesn't come to just the CEC. It comes from all of us, each and every one here. And I am so honored, so privileged to be working with men and women. Mr. Thaman yesterday alluded to the fact that our volunteers are weak and they don't stay on. I want to tell him that we have been volunteering for 25 years. Give me an SDP volunteer, SDP member anytime over a volunteer that works with a People's Association that gets $1 billion a year. I know that we cannot offer you anything. No junket trips, no priorities for schools, registration for your children, no free car park labels. Why do we do it? Why do you do it? If you search deep down in all of us, the only reason we keep pushing is because we want to see a better Singapore, a more democratic Singapore, a more just Singapore. That's what keeps us going. And that will keep us going no matter what happens on 7th of May. We will continue our work, we will continue our struggle for Singapore. And I want to be able to tell all of you that, again, I am honored and I am privileged to be working with all of you. And if I've not said it enough, you make me want to continue my work and never give up struggling for Singapore. Now is the time. Now is the time. Now is the time. Now is the time. Now is the time to take our aspirations, our dreams, our hopes to Parliament.